and you, if you hear, but then you don't do. Exactly. And you only, you only can grow, and the, and the quicker you do, the quicker you grow. Mm -hmm. And the doing helps you to grow. Yeah. If I never hear another good sermon, I'm fine. You know, <laughs> there there are plenty of sermons, but God is holding me accountable for what I do. Because once you come into the knowledge and understanding of something, then you're held responsible for the knowledge. Mm -hmm. To sit up and talk about it all day, you know, I well, I know this right. and I know that, but then you're not operated, you're being held accountable for it. And to right. quote scripture, and you're not doing it, doesn't mean yeah. a thing. And we always think that the pastor or the preacher, those leaders up there are supposed to be the doers, but exactly. the gifts are for the body of Christ. Exactly. We're supposed to be doing the same thing. That Jesus did. Exactly. And what he said in the last days, I will pour out my spirit. Yes. People ought to be prophesying, laying hands, and they ought all to do of it. it. Interpreting and speaking in tongues, but we don't do it. Casting scared. out oh, demons. Thank you. Oh, we're supposed it's to do it. We, you know what? We're so weak as a crying shame mm -hmm. the way we're weak. Mm -hmm. We just, we have the word. We have the power of the Lord. The scripture says the power that raised Jesus from the dead, dead. lives in us. We can do that too. Greater. He said we, greater than greater. We lay. He said it. Raise the dead with a touch of your hand. Mm -hmm. And we don't ever grow just like you said, baby, because we're not doing it. We just sit up there. The word is there. We see it. We don't. We don't. We, we totally ignore the power of it. Do you realize the power of the word? Hey, sweetie. How you doing? I'm so glad you came, you precious girl. Come on, have a seat. You got your Bible? Please open up your Bible. We're talking about the power of the Lord. Let's look at Mark 16, well, 17. Look before you read that. Yeah. Like she said, uh, Jesus, uh, he was 30 years old. He was right? 30 years old. Okay. And they said it was an appointed time. Right? Yes. Well, I mean, at the time, still appointed on. I mean, I, to, to me, mm -hmm. it seemed like some people try to force, like they were saying about the people go to church and they pray. Mm -hmm. And they're, but they're not doing. Mm -hmm. They got the word. They heard all the sermons. They heard all the words. Mm -hmm. Quote the Bible. Mm -hmm. Forward and back. Exactly. You know, but but they're not doing. Mm -hmm. And I mean, and the ones reason it may seem like there are so few that are doing because it's coming at an appointed time. You know, and uh, I don't know. Like you're saying, growing. Like we're growing. Like, like, like I see myself. You know, like I said, I gotten away from when I had gotten away. From, from God, but I just gotten away from going to church and, and just being there because I see too many things that were not happening in the church. So like I was telling you, you know, it's more of a spiritual thing with me, more so than religion. And, uh, We're so with, religious too. And, and with me, you know, I I, uh, I guess I'm waiting on that appointment. I'm not waiting. <coughs> Because I'm doing, you know, because I'm constantly you're trying to do something. You're growing into it then. Just like Betty says, you grow as you do. To do but something to help someone else. Yes. You know, and uh, spiritually, because religiously, you know, I don't know if, I, I don't know, I guess if I say something religious, then I will do that, you know. But I don't think that's been <coughs> pointed on me yet. So I'm still, I'm still searching, trying to find, you know, seeking. Well, let me, um. Let me kind of work this down. Um, there are some things that are immediate. Mm -hmm. Jesus just didn't spend 30 years growing up. I mean, by 12, he was like, I'm about my father's business. There, there is something uh -huh. that enters into this called Jewish tr tradition of them uh, um, staying for a period mm -hmm. with their, um, their parents. And their growth. There, there, there's some history that enters into this as far as why he was 30 when this got started. I mean, he could have started it. I mean, he at, in the, at 12 in the temples, he was in there uh, questioning the doctors and the lawyers. 